the text says in verse 20, but for Adam, there was not found a helper comparable to him. There was not found. Now, to not be found entails that a search was conducted. To not be found entails that a search was conducted. What is not found then, watch this, God makes. What is not found, God then makes. Y'all not saying nothing, but right about here, the singles ought to be celebrating because what is not found, God then creates. God then makes. Y'all not talking to me, but hold on, singles. God is making something for you. That's why you can't be such a hurry. You can't be so concerned about your biological clock. You can't be sitting around opening yourself up to every person that comes by you. If you wait, God will make sure that he makes what you need so that when it's time, what he makes will find you. What is not found, God makes. I'm trying to tell somebody he's making something for you. Well, I hear you, Bishop, but it's the I show for clear for God. I'm tired. I've just been waiting. I just been waiting and I'm so I'm so tired. I'm so tired. Well, well let me help you. The reason it's taking so long is because for God to make something as valuable as you, it takes some time for him to measure some things up. Y'all missed it. In other words, when you understand your value, you know when it's of God, He not gonna bring you no junk. So I'm not going to sit around. I'm going to dry my eyes and tell God, take your time. Because whoever you're making for me got to be worthy of who I am. The text never says there was not found a wife for Adam. It said there was not found a helper. Because Adam needed help. And in order to qualify as a wife, you must first be a helper. Brothers need help. Brothers need, brothers need help. God knows we need help. Lord Jesus, Lord knows we need help. We need help. We need help. We ain't just talking about help below the waist. Now I need help with this assignment that God put me in a garden to do. And I need to make sure that I'm connected with somebody that got some information to push me into my vision. Y'all don't want to hear me, but the vision is in the head. And the head is the covering of the wife. And in order for you to qualify as a wife, you got to come to the table with some help. Ain't no brothers that's of God looking for nails and hair and fingernails and makeup and shots in your buttocks. What we're looking for is somebody who got a word from the Lord to push us into our purpose. God in the garden means that we can no longer afford to be silent partners. Look at somebody in the face and tell them that means you got to say something. The number one issue that causes many couples to separate is communication and the lack thereof. Communication governs all areas of the relationship. If we are to have clarity about what each other feel and believe, we must sit down, communicate, and reason together. The most dangerous and tragic part of the story of Genesis 3 was the fact that during the whole ordeal, Adam said nothing. Somebody need to say something. You know why? Because when we zone out, when we don't communicate, snakes start talking. I said, when we don't communicate, snakes start talking. The text reveals that Adam was with Eve. The brother was standing right there during the whole conversation with the serpent. The scripture clearly says that after she ate, she gave some to her husband who was with her. When Eve ate the fruit, nothing happened. It was a span of time for Adam to say, honey, I love you, but you're out of order. God 
said that we're not supposed to eat of this fruit. But the brother didn't say a mumbling word. I gotta quit. But the Bible says that Adam was naming the animals. And then he named Eve. He told her who she was. But then in Genesis 3, the Bible says that the serpent who was more cunning says to Eve, did God really say? She said, yeah, the day we eat, we shall surely die. But the serpent said, you're not going to die. But God knows the day you eat of this tree, you shall be like God. And Adam says nothing. Wait a minute. In other words, Adam, that was your opportunity to step to the plate and to tell her by reminding her of who she is. If you can tell her that she's a woman, then surely you can tell her that you're already like God. And I want to tell every couple, every man, every woman, every husband, every wife, every single person, I want everybody to understand that Adam's responsibility was to always remind his wife who she is. Why? Because she been through so much father left. Mama dog counted out the black sheep of the family. She was told she would never be nothing. Abortion. Baby out of wedlock. Hooked on drugs. Prostituting. Trying to make his meat. Been beat up. Shot the head. Broken. Battered. Abused. Dogged out. Kicked out. By a man. She needs. Ah, she needs. Somebody. To take. 